Chelsea. And we have some terribly, terribly sad news to bring you uh, from the world of dark tonight here in Liverpool. Our friend and colleague, Eric Bristow, has sadly passed away at the age of 60. Uh, Eric uh, was here at the Echo Arena, uh, collapsed and was rushed to hospital, uh, but has died of a heart attack. Friend, colleague, quite simply, a darting legend, a sporting legend, a crafty cockney, Eric Bristow, who has died this evening at the age of 60. The third attempt, I was favourite the first two years I played in it, 78 and 79, so I'll be uh, Bobby George in the final. I was expected to, I expected to anyway, it wasn't, it wasn't like it, it was just, thank God that's out of the way, you know what I mean, because I expected to win the first two years. I thought we'd just keep going, it's going to come, it'll come right eventually, you know what I mean? So, uh, and it did, I mean, it, it's just another tournament, isn't it? It's just the same players in, in, in another tournament. This crowd's reaction says it all. Eric Bristow, legend. Keith Daly, you were his friend for the past 40 years. His greatest friend. Tell That's us, right. tell um, us the emotions just, you're going through tonight. I'm devastated, David. Um, doing the uh, spot on tonight and the news come through. I mean, me and Eric, we just like two together all the time. When, when he was playing darts in our day, he, was, he had the self-belief to win every tournament and he would always let us know that he was going to take the trophy home and uh, unfortunately we had to keep seeing that go in his car they have got to thank eric so big because if it wasn't for that they wouldn't be here tonight keith we've got to thank you as well some lovely words a great man thank you very much thank you bad news there bristow has passed away he was your hero one he was yeah and it, it's heartbreaking it really is he there's the two most influential men in my life have been my dad and, and Eric Christo. I, I, I've never picked up a dart without him. And even now, has there ever been a more influential dart player with, within the world of darts? There hasn't. And he hasn't shown really a competitive darts for, for, or a dart for the best part of 20 years. Uh, Eric will, will go down like, like some absolute superstars of sport, like, like Jack Nicholas and Arnold Palmer, Gary Player, and from all walks of life, people know that who where it Bristow was. Because of him, I, I started playing darts. Um, back in 1984, you know, we, we, uh, we could get uh, the BBC on, on, on TV in Holland. So we were watching the darts, you know, every time Lakeside and a couple other tournaments. And I always was a big, uh, was a big fan of Eric Bristow. So here in Liverpool, um, we, we, we heard uh, on the news that Johan Cruyff, famous Dutch footballer, passed away, you know. And now in Liverpool, Eric Bristow is passing away, which is to me quite similar people, you know. Eric Bristow was the Johan Cruyff, what, what is for us a famous football player, as, as Eric Bristow is for darts. Great guy, yeah. And uh, he will be surely missed by everyone in this sport. It says to yourself, enjoy life. That, that's, those were the last two words Eric said to me, enjoy life and, and, and don't care about the rest, do the things you want to do. Right, you get it. You can get stopped a bit in in life, but don't you know? Don't give up your dream. If your dream's to be a great businessman or whatever, whatever you want to do in life, life's great. It's, it's there. It's there to be done. He had this natural swagger about him, didn't he? He had he had that star quality. Not not many people have that. They can they can show off and that, and they can think that they've got it. But Eric had it. I've, I've worked with him for for years and, and so have you Dave you, you know him probably nine as well as I do but I, I, the best the best memory I've got of Eric was I, I won a big event as a, as a youth as a teenager uh, 15 and he presented me with with the trophy and I've got the trophy and I'm not one for memorabilia but Eric presented me that and I've got the t-shirt I've got everything I've got photos I don't keep anything like that but I've got that of Eric and and it just seems that yeah it's it's just so sad Thanks, Wayne.